Good morning. I have a 2010 Easy Go gas golf cart with the Kawasaki engine in it. It was uh, sticking, as in upshifting, if you will. It would take off and you'd have to rev it really hard. Then it would act almost like it was going into second gear. So, what I originally did, I took this pulley off here. Uh, or the centrifugal clutch. Anyways, there was nothing wrong with it. It cleaned it, put it back together. It was very simple. Uh, so my next option was to replace this one back here, the drive clutch, or, or secondary. I'm not sure which one it is. But anyways, I didn't think there was anything wrong with it because I saw uh, some people on the internet and YouTube say, hey, if you can like take this thing one hand and you can like separate it and it'll spring back, well, it's hard to see and I can't really show it to you, but inside here, these ears were had beat out on the inner part of the pulley, I guess, and it was hanging up, causing that. Unfortunate thing was, this unit here, they no longer, or they maybe still do make it, but I was told they don't. So when I got the uh, new one, it's a little bit bigger and it is very, very close to hitting this. As you can see, a matter of fact, when this goes in, it was scraping this barely. So I ended up taking my DeWalt sander and slowly turning the engine and cutting this down. So this one, I had to cut this back here really because it was just barely hitting. But anyways, that fixed it. Uh, to get this off, what you need to do, there's a bolt under here that goes through the leaf spring and take it out, jack the golf cart up, pull the rear wheel off, and just pull this bolt out here. And what I did, I came from the other side of the golf cart, from the driver's side up underneath, with like a metal rod and hit the pulley because it's pressed on. The, I think 09 and earlier models are all splined on. So that was a confusing thing I was having, I was trying to find this unit here. Uh, Matter of fact, I think I might be able to show you a part number on it. I can get the leaf over here. I'm not sure if this will help you guys or not. But anyways, here's what I ended up going back with. Uh, I think this thing is about 330 bucks. Anyways, that fixed the golf cart. It's uh, Since this pulley is bigger, it's a little bit harder getting the belt on. What I would do is I'd get it about halfway on here, best as I could, and put the golf cart in neutral, and you can bump it, and it pops. it'll pop the belt on there. But anyways, that's the fix. Thanks.